frequent colds, headaches, rashes, low libido, and mood swings can often be caused by parasites in our bodies. Getting rid of them can be challenging, so nutritionists recommend eating foods that prevent and treat parasitic worm infections known as helminthiasis. These foods are easily accessible and can be added to our diet. In this video, I have compiled a list of such foods to protect yourself from parasitic worms. Watch until the end, it's interesting and helpful. Helminths or worms are multicellular organisms with over 100 known types. They can live in our bodies for 3 years, causing various health issues by stealing resources and releasing waste. About 3 billion people worldwide suffer from helminthiasis. Helminths can reside not only in the intestines but also in the blood, lungs, liver, muscles, eyes, and brain. Symptoms can include digestive issues, gas, nausea, stomach pain, itching around the eyes, loss of appetite, coughing, anemia, muscle pain, insomnia, mood problems, and fatigue. Where do they come from? The most common sources are dirty hands, unwashed fruits and vegetables, contaminated or undercooked meat, and unclean water. Therefore, the first step in preventing helmet infections is to wash your hands, eat clean and properly cook food, and drink clean water. The specialists also recommend paying special attention to our diet as certain foods can be as effective against helmets as medications. Food high in fiber act like a cleansing agent, washing out our intestines and helping remove parasites and leftover food. Foods rich in vitamin A help reduce susceptibility to parasites, while foods containing zinc and vitamin C boost our immune system, improving gastrointestinal function, and reduce the body's susceptibility to parasites. Probiotics are also beneficial as they promote gut health. Pumpkin seeds, for example, contain a substance called cucurbitacin, which is non-toxic to humans but paralyzes helminths, preventing them from attaching to the intestinal walls, feeding, or reproducing. When helminths die, they release toxic substances. The rich complex of vitamins and antioxidants in pumpkin seeds helps the body to resist intoxication and replenish vitamin and mineral levels. Adults should consume 250 to 300 grams of raw pumpkin seeds daily to expel parasites with half the dose taken in the morning on an empty stomach and the other half before bedtime. The course should last at least 3 days. However, those with kidney stones should avoid consuming pumpkin seeds. Apple cider vinegar is also beneficial. Doctors of medical sciences assert that apple cider vinegar contains all the nutrients necessary for normal human functioning, including beta-carotene, which destroys cancer-causing free radicals. It has significant anti-helminthic effect, disrupting the nutrient environment of helminths and paralyzing the worm suckers used to attach to intestinal walls. The increased acidity deprives the worms of nutrients, destroying their eggs and inhibiting their ability to reproduce. The vitamins and amino acids in apple cider vinegar help cleanse the body of the worm's waste products. For anti-parasitic therapy, add 1 tablespoon of homemade apple cider vinegar to 250 ml of room temperature water and drink this solution half an hour before meals 3 times a day for at least 1 week. People with gastritis or peptic ulcer disease should avoid apple cider vinegar and consult a doctor before using it. Note that the maximum therapeutic effect can only be obtained from homemade apple cider vinegar A store-bought vinegar may undergo pasteurization and contain preservatives, reducing its beneficial properties. Garlic is another effective remedy. Scientific studies have shown that garlic contains substances allicin and alanase, which together form allicin. Allicin, along with phytoncides, creates a powerful weapon against bacteria, fungi, and parasites. To cleanse the body of worms, eat a clove of raw garlic on an empty stomach every morning for at least one month. However, this recipe is not suitable for people with gastritis, peptic ulcers, irritable bowel syndrome, or other gastrointestinal diseases. Turmeric is rich in vitamins and trace elements and is renowned for its ability to destroy entire colonies of helminths. Turmeric contains tumeron and curcumin, which cause metabolic disruptions in helminths, leading to their death. Additionally, 
Scientific studies have shown that curcumin causes infertility in young parasites and helps separate adult worms from their eggs. Sinole and Termiron inhibit the activity of worms while vitamin B helps cleanse the blood after the parasites die. It's important to note that turmeric in its pure form is poorly absorbed, so it should be consumed with products that aids in absorption such as black pepper and natural fats like olive oil, coconut oil, and butter. A well-regraded recipe is a turmeric infusion with ligand berry leaves. Take a 0.5 teaspoon of turmeric, 500 ml of water, and one ligand berry leaf. Crush the ligand berry leaf and mix the turmeric, then place it in a thermos and pour in boiling water. Let it infuse for at least half an hour. Drink this remedy before meals no more than 3 times a day, consuming 150 milliliters of the infusion over 2 weeks. Wormwood or Artemisia absentium creates such a hostile environment for helminths that the parasites are forced to leave the body. One of the main active substances in wormwood is setujone, which paralyzes the nervous system of parasites, causing them to be expelled naturally. Bitter wormwood has strong antiseptic, anti-inflammatory, pain-relieving, and calming properties. Its phytocytes kill and inhibit the growth of bacteria, microscopic fungi, and protozoa. Wormwood has anti-inflammatory properties and stimulates natural immunity. The roots of the plant contain a natural prebiotic inulin. These healing properties of wormwood are recognized by both traditional and official medicine. However, bitter wormwood is considered a toxic medical plant, so dosages should be not exceeded, and it should not be used for more than two weeks or at most a month. There should be a break of at least two weeks between courses. Wormwood is strictly contraindicated during pregnancy, breastfeeding, in cases of colitis, bleeding, anemia, low stomach acidity, and allergies to the plant. Caution is advised for people with gallstones, kidney stones, gastritis with high stomach acidity, and heart conditions. Wormwood for worms can be taken in its pure form or as decoction. To prepare the decoction, take a 1 teaspoon of dried wormwood, pour 300 ml of water, and bring it to a boil. Let the decoction steep for about 30 minutes. Take 100 ml 3 times a day for 2 weeks. Cloves essential oils are effective against parasites like enterobiasis and ascariasis. They contain eugenol and other compounds that destroy helminths and combat free radicals. A tablespoon of cloves provides daily manganese for bone health. Ground clove powder's most potent remedy and should be taken one third teaspoon three times a day for two to four weeks. Cloves also fight various bacteria but are not recommended for those with stomach ulcers, pancreatic issues, chronic gastritis, severe cardiovascular diseases, or during pregnancy and lactation. Pineapple. Fresh ripe pineapple, not canned, contains bromelain, which creates an unfavorable environment for helminths. Broccoli contains style with strong antiparasitic and antifungal properties and rich in fiber. Pomegranates, high in iron, potassium, antioxidants, fiber, and vitamin C, pomegranates boost immunity and eliminate parasites. Limit to one per day to avoid side effects like hypertension and dizziness. Pepper. Black, red, and cayenne peppers are effective against parasites and microorganisms. Use in moderation. Cleansing the body of worms should be done every six months. During this process, avoid milk, flour, and confectionery products. For more tips, subscribe to our channel, like the video, and share with friends and family.